Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about a frustrating issue a lot of players have been running into in Schedule 1, the infamous stuck on loading screen bug. If your game freezes at loading data, or just stays on the loading screen even though you can hear sounds or see some interface elements, you're not alone. It's been happening to a lot of players, especially after saving and quitting, or trying to load into a multiplayer session. It seems like the game either doesn't fully load the world or gets stuck halfway, and this can be super frustrating, especially if you've made a lot of progress on your save. One common cause, especially in multiplayer, is not being Steam friends with the host. For some reason, the game has trouble syncing players unless everyone is connected through Steam. So if you're trying to join a friend's game and getting stuck, make sure you and your friend have each other added on Steam. This little step has actually fixed the issue for a lot of people, so it's definitely worth trying before diving into more complicated fixes. Another thing that seems to help is starting a new save or hosting the game yourself. A lot of players mentioned that they couldn't join someone else's game, but when they hosted, everything worked fine. If you're just trying to test whether the issue is with your save or with multiplayer in general, this is a quick way to find out. And yeah, I know it's not ideal if you've already got a lot of progress, but at least it's a way to still enjoy the game while waiting for a more permanent fix. Now if you're stuck on a single player save, or even the menu isn't loading right, try lowering your graphics settings. I know that sounds basic, but it's actually helped several players get past the loading screen. Set your resolution to something reasonable, turn off any extras like SSAO, God Rays, or anti-aliasing, and try launching again. Also, check if your PC meets the game's minimum requirements. Some users reported crashes or freezes caused by low memory or insufficient video power. If nothing else works, try verifying the integrity of your game files through Steam. And as a last resort, uninstalling and reinstalling the game has worked for some players too. Just make sure you back up your saves first if you can. Hopefully one of these fixes helps you get back into the game. It's clear that the devs are still working through a lot of bugs since the game's gotten more popular than expected. Let me know in the comments if any of these fixes worked for you, or if you found a different solution that others should try. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more quick fixes and gaming updates. Thanks for watching.